create a game object, this is where the particle will collide with. Add a collider to the game object, I will use a box collider. Assign a sprite. I will just resize the collider to fit our wall. Now add a particle system. change the material to sprites default. Next check texture sheet animation, change grid to sprites and assign a sprite. I will adjust some settings to the particle, you don't have to because this is just a visual preference, you can change yours the way you want your particle to be. Now that I'm okay with how my particle looks like, I will now add collision to the particle, to do that check collision, right below the noise. Change planes to world, and change 3D to 2D. Now you can change some options, this is all up to you. Bounce makes your particle bounce when is collide with another collider. Lifetime loss allows you to destroy a particle when collide. Radius scale, you can adjust the collider of your particle in here. I will keep it to 1. Collides with, this gives you an option on what layer your particle will collide with, right now it everything is selected so our particle will collide with every game object that has collider. Here I will show you how to make a layer for your game object. Name it what you want, and assign it to your game object. I will make another game object, this is our player. I will also give it its own layer. Now back to our particle, right now it collides with both game object. Let's try choosing only the wall layer. Now the part Klee only collides to the wall and not the player.
The last thing you need is check the send collision messages. Now let's go back to our wall object, and create a script, I will name it wall script. In the script I don't need the start and update function. Now add void on particle collision, this will allow us to check if a particle collides with the wall. For now I will debug first if this script will work. Double check if your script is in the wall game object. As you can see the script works fine. You can put whatever you want inside this function. For example you can disable a game object when a particle collides. You can increment a score for your game or spawn an enemy, you can add what you want. Thank you for watching, hit like if this helps you, and subscribe for more.